Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how you can compress a video and convert it to a different file. So, I have this video file here. Um, this is my uh, old video. And if you uh, look at properties, it's 4.29 gigabytes. This is going to take a lot of time to upload on YouTube, and I don't want to wait that much time because I don't want to put my computer on that time. So, yeah, this. Uh, is an AVI file type and yeah it's my old so I wanna compress it so it's, it's a free piece of software called free make video converter you can find it here www.freemake.com slash free underscore video underscore converter backslash so you just click download and then uh, install the file it'll walk you through the setup it's really simple but this is a really good program. I really recommend this for the people who need to convert files or compress. Because it converts, but it also compresses. But it doesn't know that. So so we're just started up here. Alright, so what you want to do is click video. And search for your video. So mine's on the desktop. So yeah, where is it? Right here. We'll select that and click open. Or you can just drag and drop. So this is our video. It tells we recorded by Fraps, 1920 by 1080, 16 by 9, how many gigabytes, 50 FPS. So yeah, it tells us all that. So we want to just select it. And as you can see, you have lots of you. You have AVI, WMV. You can also, in this program, this program is that cool for free. You can convert audio and pictures. This, and it has a little editing tool in it too. So you can edit it as well. Okay, so... Yeah, see, this is the editing tool. Um, you can edit it, cut it into pieces. Small little editing tool. It's really good. And if you have a bunch of files, you want to join them and, and convert them, you can also do that. You could just click join files, and then you convert all the files into one, which is really handy, but it makes your file size a lot bigger. So if you're looking for a small file size, yeah, I wouldn't do it. But otherwise, it's, it works perfectly. You can also burn a DVD here and all that stuff. So... Right now we want to convert it. When we convert it, it's going to make our file size smaller. So wh uh, what I like doing is MP4 personally. I like because MP4 usually works with everything. So yeah. Um, you want to... So I changed my settings. So uh, you, uh, ev here's everything, right? But you go to settings because yours wouldn't have this. You want to change your codec to video codec to H.264 because that is what YouTube uses so if if you have it on MPEG-4 it's going to need to convert it back so it'll take more time so I recommend this here and then of uh, the frame rate um, I will put 50 frames per second actually 30, 30 frames per second because that's what the human eye 29.97 uh, is what the human eye sees so 30 just to make sure whoops and bit rate we can do auto and video codec AAC we don't really care about this but st st their channels I like it on stereo um, sample rate 32,000 HZ that's what I like it at and here what we can for the bit rate we can do 32k BPS and then you can name it to whatever I named the YouTube because this is how I upload and I click OK and I choose where I want to put it desktop and I'll just add something else so it wouldn't be this so I would know the difference and I would click convert now it will convert depending on how big of a file size you have the more time it will take but yeah I'll pause the video here and I'll uh, Alright guys, so as you can see it says conversion completed, conversion was completed successfully, click OK and click close and we can exit out of here. Alright, now our video file is right here, so this was our 4.29 gigabytes and let's see the properties. 25.7 megabytes, that is amazing. And if you see, it's, it's, the, it's the same video. It, but I have done it with about like, and if you look at this, same video, but I have done it with about like 11 pictures. See, as you can see, it's the same video, but this one is way smaller 25.7, 4.29.
four point twenty nine. So as I remember, as you could see, I remember how label just typed in random letters. Yeah, this is one, and it's twenty five point seven megabytes. This is AVI, this is MP4, and it's, that's the difference. So this is a very helpful tool. I really recommend it, and it's really easy to use. So and this was my tutorial, guys, on how to compress and convert files. Um, uh, thanks for watching. Please, please leave a like and have a great day.